Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Rubble, and welcome to the Nebula Station, the Blarg Station for all of their weapons and gadget development and testing. So, at this point, I'm not sure which part is the primary objective and which one is the secondary objective. This one just says, explore the station. So I don't know what order I'm supposed to do it in. I got... I think that's the trespasser. But wait, no, oh, that's just a shield. I can break that, right? Yeah, I can just break those. And then there's that, where you have to escape from the ship, the, um, you have to escape from the other ship. And then there, hey, there's a new thing. I got some great bargains for you today. I'll take it, taunter. Now see, there it is again, another weapon I don't remember. That's why I'm glad I replayed this. I don't remember the taunter. Uh, let's not purchase any ammo. I like breaking ammo crates. <laughs> Maybe, uh, it'll tell me how to use it? So, let's see. I can go through here, and that gets me the grind boots, and I come out through there. I think the primary path is to the left. So I need to do the other two paths first. Let's do... Let's do this one first, and then the right over here, and then the left over here. Which is probably the exact opposite from what I'm supposed to do, but I actually cannot remember. That's what the taunter did. It brings enemies towards you with all those goofy sounds. You can lure them into traps and stuff. And now... Trespasser. Wasn't there an option to... Gadgets. Backpacks. Items held. There was an option to like... Hmm. Quick select. Yeah, you can customize your... Uh, you can customize your quick select items. Interesting. I like how that says L1 and R1, and yet on my controller it's L2 and R2, so it's the exact opposite. Um, I'll customize that later. For now, I actually do need the option to do that. Oh, okay, so we're, we're good. Let's do it. Um, I remember some of the ones on this one being kind of difficult. This one's just a wee bit difficult. Just a wee bit. Uh, okay, okay, we got... The blockers are in my way. I might just skip <laughs> to this... Oh lord, yeah, just just skip this part. Got it! Oh thank god. That took forever. Ah, well it wasn't that bad. Hey, and look, it's the first section where you can actually play as Clank. Button. I remember always really enjoying the Clank sections. I think everybody did. They just made it feel... And that's another thing they took out of the remake. Um, there are no... Wait, no, there are. Oh, my bad. I'm sorry. There are. Gotta give them credit on that one. They did They did put some Clank sections in the remake. So that, that actually does give... Oh! That does give them some character diversity, and also it's a little bit more difficult to control Clank. I didn't know he made that sound if you go slow with him. Hang on. Regular speed? Oh, and there's a gold bolt. And um, then slow speed. That is adorable. <laughs> yeah, if you just barely press the analog stick. I can't believe I never did that on the original play, uh, PS2. Get punched! <laughs> You gotta admit, look at those giant... I mean, for a robot his size, those big fists? I mean, come on, man. He's like, um, you know how the theory about ants? How they can lift a hundred times their own weight? Proportionally, Clank is freaking ridiculously strong. Like, by proportions, he's just out of there. Because, uh, now that I think about it, he was actually a, um, a glitch that was made, um, from one of the larger robots. What if... Jump. Then press and hold the X button again while in the air to glide. Because remember, he was made um, to be one of those destroyer bots, but there was a bug in the system and he was made small. What if proportionally he still has their strength, just at his size? Never thought about that. Dun 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 dun. Okay, okay. Hey, I remember this part. This is where you can get the little helper bots. Uh-oh. <laughs> I thought that one had me for sure. I think Clank only has, like, 
two or three nanotech as well, so he's only got a couple of hits that he can take. It's a fun section for the level, though. I like how it adds the diversity, you know? You can really... The heck? That looks like a gold bolt. But I know it's not. <laughs> huh. Never noticed that before. Hey, look, it's another one. What if those are the gold bolts you can see on other, on other distant planets? You never know. Oh, man, the height of the PlayStation 2. Good times, good times. Uh, at least the height, in my opinion. Shoot. Wait, was there a thing up here? I don't ever remember. No, that's just the platform above me. Okay, because I'm pretty sure I got everything back in the day when I used to play this. I'm pretty blasted sure. Oh, I could have gone through there as well. I did turn down the music because uh, I don't mind, um, you know, somebody else getting ad revenue. You know, if they own the license to the games now or the license to the music. I don't mind at all because I don't plan on monetizing it. But I don't want it to get removed entirely from the platform. That can also happen. Like, you, it can get completely deleted. And if I don't have a backup, I can't reload it. I'll have to re-record it all over again. Which, I've been thinking about getting an external hard drive as a backup for some of my uh, Let's Plays. Because uh, one of them actually got completely removed from the... Uh, oh, dang it. No, I don't remember how to get that. Gotta get it. Gotta figure out how to get it. Okay, so I guess I tried... I mean, there's no... Unless I can get above it somehow. Hang on. This button. Yeah, that's not that's not going to happen. I don't know. I'll figure it out later, I guess. But for now, we are simply enjoying the game. There is a slight difference on the emulator. Every now and again, it'll slow down, but I'm not sure about that. Hey, look, it's the little bot. You have just activated a gadget bot. To command a gadget bot, hold down the triangle button and select wait, follow, attack, or enter. Beautiful. Love it. Ah, I love it. Those are one of my favorite enemies from the original game. Uh, we're gonna go attack. Oh, and that sound. I remember that sound. Maybe getting inside of here has something to do with how I get that gold bowl. I don't know, I'm sure someone will look it up and see that I, I'm pretty sure I was right. That you're supposed to be able to grab onto those vents, but... I wonder what other... I wonder if that is a bug, and if so, how many more bugs there are. Because that's, uh, that's concerning. But then again, it's just a gold bolt, and there's no achievements. So as long as I can complete the game and get all the weapons, I think I'll be happy with that. Uh, enter. I used to love the puzzles that they make out of those guys. They're really funny. The Hydro Displacer! Go ahead. Got it. <laughs> That's where that meme comes from. Frickin' Clank's weird laugh. Uh. The Gadgetron Hydro Displacer uses insta faucets and insta drains. Using it, you can drain and fill pools. Our sensors do not detect any on this space station. Mm-hmm. Okay, so nothing out here. Alrighty, alrighty. Oh, gosh. Well, I'm pretty sure I was supposed to be able to grab those vents to get to that gold bowl. I'm about 90% on that one. But, uh, um, I don't think there's anything I can do about it. Oh well, it's one gold bolt. Maybe I'll boot up the game and it'll be interactable again, who knows. I'm gonna frickin' look that up. I'm gonna frickin' Google that. As soon as I finish this planet, that's gonna bug me. I'm back. So you are. And I found this. Hey, cool. Pull. It's a, uh, uh, what is it? A hydro displacer. Great. I always wanted one of those, I guess. Yeah, uh, you're gonna wind up. Did you know you can place any gadget or weapon on your quick select? Just pause and choose quick select from the menu. I'll have to do that later. But yeah, Ratchet, you're going to wind up needing that Hydro Displacer. Anyway, um, what was it? Oh, I was, oh, I lost my train of thought. I was going to say I was thinking, um, oh, then we'll go to this path. 
This shuttle has an autopilot which will take you to a decommissioned Larg warship. Our scanners indicate that there may be useful technology on board. Hmm, I feel like I should do that last because it's kind of an epic climax. Yeah, let's do that last. Dun dun dun! I have no idea. I don't know if that's actually the proper order or what. Ooh! Okay, there we go. Nice. Nailed it. Uh, let's see. Glove of Doom! Wait, I don't really need the... If there's only the one frog, I don't need it. Okay. I need it. Actually, the, the flamethrower would be a lot more, um... What do you call it? Um... Efficient? Ammo efficient? Yeah. Haha. <laughs> Something like that. Pyro tractor. That's. I think that's just what I'm gonna pronounce it as. Like, uh, cause I can't. I can't pronounce it. But I'm just gonna say pyro and then tractor. Pyro tractor. Cause I mean, pyro si pyro sator. I had. I had this issue in an earlier episode. Uh, bomb glove. <laughs> I got him. Need a little help with these enemies? Try your taunter. Hmm. My taunter, eh? Well, that just brings them towards me. wonder what I could do. I could set up some sort of a trap. Probably. Break that. Break that. Maybe it means, uh, maybe it taunts them so that they, uh, stop doing that whole flame thing. Shoot, let's try it. Oh, gosh. Didn't think it could reach me from there. Um, taunter. I should probably do the quick select thing now. Hang on, I'll do this real quick. Um, oh lord. Gadgets, that. Uh, hmm. I'll do it later. Oh! It forces him into that mode. So he's trying to hit me melee style. <laughs> nice. Ooh, bomb gloves good for those guys. Get several of them all at once. Ah, I remember this. Um, trespasser. Got him. Okay, I guess I'll. Oh god, this one's gonna be another difficult one, so I'll probably have to just uh, skip part of it at least. Oh wow, it's all three blockers, just blockers, wow. Now I just want to get these out of the way, wait. Dude, I have it, it's so close, hang on. Oh, thank God. Nope. Oh, really? Cheeky brothers. <laughs> nice. Oh, I just love doing that. And then all the ammo I get, that's freaking awesome. Lord have mercy. This is going to wind up being a bit longer of a recording uh, that I'm going to have to edit out a lot of the different um, trespasser uh, sections because that actually does take a bit of time. It's awfully dark in that room. I think we're coming up on one of my favorite boss battles that they took out of the remake. Also, I'm not going to get those crates. I, I don't feel like it's worth it. Or is it? I don't know. I could go... I don't know. It's, it's too risky. Forget it. All that gas. So far, it's uh, pretty much exactly the same, even though it's on an emula uh, emulator. Uh, apparently, they have, um, expected me to take a lot of damage on that one. Then, of course, there's this guy. Swing shot. I can just jump over his fire. I don't really need the, uh, what do you call it? Um, dang it, now I forget the name of it. The, um, the taunter. Ah, I forgot you could break those lights. Sweet. And of course, some of the frickin' boxes are now mutant frogs. 
because that's that's just fine. Let's go with Club of Doom as soon as these guys pop out. I don't think they're going to pop out until I hit both of these, though. Oh, nope. One at a time. Oh, god dang. Club of Doom. <laughs> they didn't hardly give me no time. They just jumped him off right in front of me. Yeah, see, it starts like a cutscene. Like, now he's he's here. Oh, god. Did he get me? Dang it, he got me. There we go. God dang. Oh, and I remember... Ah, oh, there we go. I remember those. You have to use TNT to blow them up. Dang, so what's my health at now? Uh, god dang it. Well, there's some HP back here I can get. Um, oh, suck cannon. That'll take care of them. And now it's full. <laughs> that is the most efficient method. That is the method that I will now go with. There's, there's no way. They just, they can't handle this. And then you just hold it down and keep on bringing them in. Perfect. It's flawless. It has no flaws. It is, it is devoid of flaws. Except for that one. Woo! Oh, dang it. Ah. Jump over the fan. Uh, jump over the flame. Jump over the flame. Excellent, excellent. Glove of Doom. Nanotech. And Gadgetron. Oh. I got some great bargains for you today. Uh, suck cannon? Hurry? Okay. We're gonna get these and then throw them at the aliens. Nope. Not today. Now today. God dang, how did that not deal enough damage to take you out? Bomb glove? Nope. <laughs> Just keep messing with him. Okay, now bomb glove. Dang, really? God dang it. Oh god. Really? You guys are killing me. Okay. Well, that's a thing. More ammo! Heck, I almost feel like putting out the Glove of Doom minions just to keep me safe while I break through these uh, defenses. As a matter of fact, that's not a bad idea. Let's get the Glove of Doom, and then break this in case there's any enemies. There they go! Get them, boys! Got them. And then, of course, there's this top section up here. I think there was a gold bolt here, wasn't there? No, that'd be too easy. I can't remember. I'm still like 98% sure that um, that gold bolt in the clank section was um, inaccessible due to a glitch. But hey, it's whatever. Oh, there is a gold bolt here. Wait a minute. Uh, what's the best way to handle this? Bomb glove. Okay, that's going to be a little bit difficult. There we go. I think we got all but two or three of them. And now we got them all. Gold Bolt! So there was one there, I was right. Frickin' awesome. Ah, bo uh, Glove of Doom ammo. That stuff is worth its weight in gold later on. Because again, like I said, Glove of Doom, one of the best weapons in the game, in my opinion. Speaking of which... Let's get it going. Take out that guy, guys. Take take out that guy. He's he's a threat. Got him. <laughs> you can use your blaster on those too, but I prefer to save the ammo. And then of course, uh, glove of wait. Equip it, then throw it. Don't want it falling off the edge. Should be able to get both of them. Two hits each. Two. Dang it. We're one short. Ah, we'll just polish him off with the wrench. Ooh! <laughs> they're, they're quicker than you realize. Real trouble there. Let's just go blaster on these ones. Got him. Oh, wow, it went around. That's convenient. If only my little guys could make it over there. 
Oh well. HP! Got him. And I guess we'll just take out this one just for funsies. Alright, now we've got that fully unlocked. <gasps> this is it! This is the fight! The fight! The Alien Queen! Gonna do this. Make sure she can't get me. And look, she's got an HP bar! Why'd they take this fight out? And then she summons minions! Uh, suck cannon. Oh, God! Uh, nope! Ah. No! Oh! God dang it! Ah! No! Oh my God! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Dang! I don't remember it being like that! I don't know. Maybe maybe the AI isn't quite as great as it used to be. Bomb glove. Or glove of doom. No! Don't fly off the edge. That part's pretty easy. Uh-oh. Well, that's it's better against her anyway. Now for the minions, I'm going to need Pyro Tractor. Nope. Not today. Not this time. See, some of them are almost getting to me. You gotta know the strats. Uh, like run away. Oh. Oh god. Come on, glove of doom ammo. Okay. So, let her do her thing, and then switch to the glove of doom. And I don't have any ammo for her. What, a pyro support? Pyro tractor! Take damage! Oh. Man, what is a good way to. Oh god. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, that deals a lot of damage. Okay, so now she's got these things going on. Nope. Nope, not today. Okay, now I'm going to refill my HP because I think I took a hit. Or at least break this uh, nanotech in case I... Yep. Oh! Wait a minute, is there... I thought there was an exploit. It looked like if I got far enough away from her, she'd just wander on back. Let's try it. Nope. Whee! Yeah, there she goes. Now I can do this. Haha! <laughs> Maybe that's why they took the fight out. Got him. Okay, I found the exploit. You just gotta get far enough away from her and uh, wait for her, uh, like her to finish her cycle of attacks, and she wanders away. Still tough fight though. I remember it being one of my favorites when I was a kid. It it, it was difficult, and even as an adult, it still got me. I wasn't expecting that many freaking mutant frogs to come out. Was not expecting that. And there was also another achievement for uh, breaking all of the um, breaking all of the lamps in the station. I think. Whew. Thought I was a goner this time. Saved him. Nano wit and genetics must have left the cages open again. You could come down now. Honestly, a gadget engineer deserves a bit more respect, if you ask me. So you are an inventor. Gadget engineer. I create revolutionary devices for Executive Chairman Drek. For instance. The Viola. My soon-to-be-patented grind boots. Look, I, I I need to get out of here so I can find a new job. How about I sell you these? At cost. Sell? After we just saved your scrawny butt? All right, all right. I'll give you the employee discount, too. I'll take them. Well, thanks. I'm gonna get out of here while I still can. Okay, I guess I was doing things in the proper order. You bought the grind boots. Nice. Here we go. This is fun. Oh, yeah. Maybe this is how I was supposed to get that gold bolt. <laughs> I don't remember. I don't think so, though. Sweet. It's very much how I remember it. I feel like it was a bit faster back in the day, though. 
Whoosh! Wham! Ow! <laughs> and then you can just go straight to here. So, maybe that was the order uh, of events. Who knows? But, uh, that's fine by me. I've already got, like, almost 10,000 bolts. Which is uh, interesting, because it's like, um... I don't remember things being so cheap, but okay. And then here's the last section here. The warship! That thing looks freaking cool. Sweet. And I can take either path, but they're both... They're both... Oh, well, I thought I could. I was about to say, they're both basically the same. Uh... Taunter. Now dang. You can't hit me and I can't hit you. Come back here. Let me hit you. Got him. <laughs> what a strange reality we live in. Where I'm getting hit in a, where I'm getting hit in a game that was released in the early early two thousands? Late nineties? I'm not sure. Yeah, this is the part where I can go out of the way. Uh Pyro Tractor. Or suck cannon, that'll... Yeah, yeah. That deals with them real good. The only real issue is, like, whenever it fills completely full, uh, if there's still any enemies left over, it might cause problems. Got him. Got him. Okay, uh, Blaster's got a bit more range. Almost out of ammo for it, though. There you go. Oh, whoa, that one went over me. All right. Nice. Bomb glove? Or glove of doom. Bomb glove. Bomb glove and glove of doom. I'm getting them mixed up. Uh, I don't know why, but I'm going to take these guys out. Good gravy. <laughs> Got them. I don't know. They're worth the bolts. That'll do it. And then there's some bolts over here. And swing into this area. Aliens! Glove of Doom time! Because there's still two of these guys left. I wish I could keep the camera in this position. One hit, two hit. Ah, dang it. If there's more than one, it like... It divides them unevenly. And it's so sad. Sweet. Because now there's going to be little... Little guys left over. Little little glove of doom guys left over. Now they're all lonely. They don't have any enemies to take. Uh, they don't have any enemies to KO. Uh, let's see. Do 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 do. What was that? Get all the bolts. Then do the thing. What does this say? Press the big red shiny button. Well, of course. <laughs> Thank you for selecting our automated self-destruct feature. Vessel annihilation sequence initiated. Please remove all personal belongings. I did do it in the right order, because the other two sections were for um, gadgets, and this section is for... Um, woo! <laughs> this section is for the, um, the info bot to the next planet. Dang it, how do they keep getting me? God dang it, how do I keep getting got? Okay, god dang. I don't remember that being so cramped in the original. Parts of this game are going to be really freaking hard for me if it's like... Oh, cutscene. That's awesome. What's sad is that that's a more accurate explosion than most of the ones you see in the movies. Because, you know, space and a vacuum. This is Darla Gratch reporting live from Blackwater City. We've just learned that Captain Quark will be presenting the grand prize at the Intergalactic Hoverboard Championship, which will be held here over the next few days. In related news, this planet has recently been suffering from an infestation of strange amoeboid creatures. The city's administration has assured this reporter that every step has been taken to eradicate these nuisances. Darla Gratch, Channel 2 News. Done. Did you see that? Yes, I hope that poor woman is all right. Ah, uh, she's fine. 
I think. I was talking about the hoverboard races. <laughs> Love it. And then uh, that's the part where I get the uh, the prize from the hoverboard competition, and I can take it back to uh, Skid's agent. Okay, well, uh, this one actually ran over a long time, but part of that is because I got KO'd a couple of times, and um, what was the other thing I was thinking? Um, I got some great bargains for you today. I got KO'd a couple of times, and I spent a long time trying out the trespassers. But uh, I guess it is time I um, started buying some ammo. Because <laughs> I guess you can't get it all just through the crates. Because I am running extra, uh, expertly low on some of these. Okay, maxed out there. Especially That's the Glove of Doom. Beauty. And I mean, I've got like a lot of bolts. So I'm going to go on ahead and buy some ammo and then save. And we'll start the next episode right after this one.